What's up guys, it's your girl JQ with JQ Sports PR and I'm here at one of the hottest ATL sneaker store at Heat ATL and I'm joined today by 6'6 guard from Buford High School, Marcus Watson. So Marcus, are you ready to talk about ball and sneakers? Right, let's go. Let's go. So Marcus, you're going into your senior season this year at Buford. What are some of the personal goals that you have set for yourself? Uh, you know, my team, um, we Buford, I want to uh, win the state championship. Okay. Uh, we got to be this year, so it's most of goal to go back and win this year, actually. You and your team are expected to have, to have a great season this year. If your coach gave you the opportunity to choose a team shoe, what shoe would it be? Uh, team shoe probably I go with the uh, I probably go with the regular. Okay. Okay. Yeah, because I mean we uh, green and gold. Uh -huh. so, I mean gold shoes. I mean Jordans. Like who else gonna wear? I think my teammates like it too. Do you think your coach will like it? Uh, my coach is kind of old school. So I don't know. I don't know. But I mean it's gold. It's school colors, green and gold. So I mean. It's Jordans. I mean, who doesn't like Jordans? Right, so, right. I know my teammates will like them because they all, they all like Jordans. So just look at it. It's nice. I mean, retro sixes. Mm -hmm. Who else would want? I mean, I agree. They do look fine. So as everyone knows, you're the top player, one of the top players in Georgia, and I'm pretty sure there's some friendly competition with another top player in Georgia. Who is that player, and what is it like playing in this one? Another top player. I give it to. Uh, Can't wait to see what he's doing this upcoming years, for upcoming season. Mm -hmm. and, uh, just looking forward to him. Uh, overall, great player. Okay. Now everyone has their favorite all-time shoe. Okay. So if you had to wear a specific shoe for the rest of your life, what shoe would it be? I mean, me too. From North Carolina, bro. Okay, UNC. Okay. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. It's my favorite color. It's Carolina blue. Rock with the eleven. Jordan, I like Jordan, so I mean, and growing up in North Carolina, I'm North Carolina, no problem there. Right. So, I'm going to Carolina Blue. Okay. So, Marcus, you have a lot of schools, I mean, everyone is recruiting you. Talk about that list, and what are going to be some of the things that you're going to consider before making that decision? Uh, you know, I got, I got a lot of schools like Florida, Missouri, Georgia Tech, Georgia, um, Florida State, uh, the list goes on and on. Yeah, right? State, yeah, it's a lot, but I mean, I just can't think of them all right now. Mm -hmm. But it's a lot of schools, I and mean, the things I consider like uh, the environment I'm being, the, mm -hmm. I like I like fans. Okay. I feed off energy, so I mean, I love uh, go to big school with a lot of energy, uh, mm -hmm. a lot of fans. Um, the coach, the relationship with the coaches, and just overall like, academics of the school, how they if I was to get hurt or injured, I can come back to school, finish school out, and my degree, how it be my yeah, for looking for a job around the world. Right. That's what you're going to do forever. So right, that is true. That is so, true. Um, but I'm fortunate enough, I'll be fortunate enough to make it to the NBA. That's my dream goal. Uh, but other than that, just going to where I know I can play right off the bat and just doing what's best for me. Now, what is the misconception that people have of you as a person? Because you look pretty shy and very, <laughs> you know, just. Yeah, I get that a lot. People say I'm shy. and like Because when I go to, like, I kind of say to myself a little bit. But mm -hmm. once you get to know me, I open up to you. I, I can talk and I talk a lot. <laughs> I kind of get that from my mom. Oh, I Lord. can talk from time. <laughs> but yeah, so I mean, I'm an outgoing person. Once you get to know you, I open up to you. But other than that, I'm, I get that I'm shy. Or sometimes when you really get to know me, I talk a lot. Okay. But I mean, other than that, I'm just, that's just how I am. Okay. Now, it's a popular trend that you have couples matching with their sneakers and put them, putting them on the ground. Mm -hmm. If you had to do a, a picture with your girl and y'all had to take a photo, 
Put <laughs> sneakers matching. What shoe on this rack would you choose? Uh, you know, my girlfriend, she played basketball. So. Oh, okay, so she's a baller. Okay. Yeah, so okay. I mean, I mean, she'll probably go, if we were matching, depending on the fit, too, you know, you okay. gotta match the fit, but. Same going and everything out there with these. Like okay, the okay. I think she would be very proud yeah, of yeah, that she, shoe. She, she, she like it. <laughs> she right with these. Yeah, I look nice. You like them? I like them. I think you get an A for that. What's your girlfriend name? Sarah. Sarah, Sarah. <laughs> so for the fourth time in NBA history, we got the Cavs facing off the Golden State Warriors. Who do you have winning the championship this year, Marcus? Um. I'm gonna have to go with the Warriors. So the Warriors, to, okay. Yeah, I want them to go back to back. I mean, KD's got his first win last year. I want them to come back and win it back to back this year. Mm -hmm. uh, and I mean, LeBron's been going to the finals. I think it's like eight straight. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I want, I want him to win this year. He's a great player, but I want him to win this year. I, I have to agree, but if you had to choose two other teams to play in the championship, what two teams would you want to want to see in yeah, the championship? I mean, my team is the Rockets. Oh, the Rockets. Oh, yeah, okay. They lost. Okay. They had Chris. They had Chris. They would beat the Warriors. I Ooh. think so. That's a whole nother story. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the Rockets and go with the Celtics. If Celtics had Kyrie, I would. So okay, they had okay. Kyrie. So if they had Kyrie, then yeah. If they had Kyrie and um, Gordon Hayward, I'd go with them. Okay, okay. But if I had to choose another team, I'd go with the Rockets and hometown team, the Hornets. Okay, all right, I hear you. <laughs> no chances are low, but you know, <laughs> go with the Hornets. I, I definitely hear you. Well, Marcus, our time is up, but I want to thank you so much for taking the time out to chill with JQ today. Be sure you guys to follow this up and coming superstar and don't forget to stay true to yourself. It's Marcus Watson, JQ, shout your Instagram. Instagram underscore MW underscore underscore 14. And we're out. Wow. Catch y'all later.